Hello, everyone. Welcome to watching Lesson Twenty of Super Kid for Arduino Serials video tutorial. Small fan. Let's see the platinum first. Here we can see the fan will not rotate after power on. If the button is pressed once, the small fan will rotate slowly. If the button is pressed twice, it will rotate at a medium pace. If the button is pressed three times, it will rotate rapidly. If the button is pressed four times, it will stop. Next. Let's see the components to be used in this experiment. Then from the UO control board, breadboard, USB cable, jumper wheels, a DC motor, a 10 k ohm resistor, a button, and a 293D chip. Let's see the principle of this experiment. The principle of this experiment is to control the rotational speed of the motor by having it read the amount of times the button is pressed. After startup, the default gear is zero and the fan will not rotate. If the button is pressed once, the small fan will enter gear one and rotate slowly. If the button is pressed twice, it will enter gear two and rotate at a medium pace. If the button is pressed three times, it will enter gear three and rotate rapidly. If the button is pressed four times, it will return to gear zero and stop. That's all for the pistol. Let's start building the kit. Place the 293D chip on the breadboard. Collect pins four and five to ground. Collect pins 8 and 1 to 5 volts power source. Collect pin 7 to pin 9 of the board. Collect pin 2 to pin 10 of the board. Collect pins 3 and 6 to two ends of the motor. Then place the button on the breadboard. Collect a 10 k ohm pull down resistor to one end of the button. Collect the other end of the button to 5 volts power source. Collect the end collected with the resistor to pin 2 of the board. Collect the sand from the board and the breadboard. After building the kit, let's start programming. Collect the button to pin 2 of the board. On board LED is collected to pin 13 of the board. Collect pin 7 of the 293D chip to pin 9 of the board. Collect pin 2 of the 2 lan 3D chip to pin 10 of the board. This variable is used to indicate the speed of the fan. Define PWM value corresponding to 3 speed levels. This variable is used to indicate the state of the LED. This variable is used to indicate the state of the button. This variable is used to indicate the last state of the button. Record the last time when the button is pressed. The debounce time of the button. Set pin 2 as input. 
Set pin 13 as output. Set pins 9 and 10 as output. Start serial port. Read state of the button. The following is for button debug. If the state of the button is still 1 after debug, change the state of the LED. The value of that increase progressively. Switch the speed level of the fan according to the value of that. This function is used to set the speed of the motor, which is determined by the variable speed. It ranges from 0 to 255. Compare. Download. That's all for this lesson. Thank you for watching. See you next time.